Hey everyone, so today I have a room tour for you guys. It is probably my most highly requested video, like I think without a doubt, except like a boyfriend tag, which is not going to happen anytime soon, but um, I get so requested to do a room tour, and the room I actually film in is my walk-in closet. It's not actually my room. So I decided to show you guys my room. Keep in mind, um, one, I'm an adult. <laughs> so my room is very minimal. I don't have everything just crammed into one space. I mean, I have a living room. I have, you know, my second bedroom, which I made a walk-in closet slash office. So my room is very minimal. It's like a bed, um, some perfumes, and like a bathroom. It's nothing like spectacular, but since you guys really requested the room tour, I decided to go ahead and film it for you guys. Um, also, if you guys like the room tour and want to see maybe a closet tour or, you know, want to see an apartment tour, I am more than willing to. I like, I personally like my sense of style, but it's not for everybody. Um, some people may call it tacky. I love it, and so I'm very, I'm more than proud to show you guys everything that is in my room. Um, so just, like I said, just bear in mind, like, all my makeup and jewelry and stuff is in a different room, so it's not going to be in that uh, in my bedroom. But it's fun. If I hope it give you guys some ideas. Nothing is sponsored in this video. Um, I bought everything myself. So, you know, rest, rest, I was gonna say rest in peace, but hopefully you'll have a peace of mind when you go through it and I'll be like, oh my god, whatever. Um, so yeah. So anyways, I guess here is my room tour. I hope you guys enjoy and I will see you at the end of the video. Okay, so this is the entrance of my bedroom. Um, I never have door closed just because I like, I mean, I live by myself, so I just like to have my doors open. I don't know why. It just gives me a sort of open setting, but to divide my rooms, I put that little, um, what do you call it, like silver, like disco ball curtains. Um, I just got these offline. I just typed in Dancing with the Stars beaded curtains, and it's like the first one that popped up. So, um, yeah, I really like them. There's a couple missing on this one, but I also have them behind me, if you can hear that. Um, so, also, too, my room is pretty simple because I do have my closet slash office over there. So, if you guys want a tour of that, make sure you like up this video. So, anyway, let's get into the bedroom. Um, so, you go through my curtains. And, um, just on my door, I don't have anything, like, my door is not cluttered at all. Especially, not even the back. But, um, that is my Henry Bendel bag that I'll be using for the spring. I just thought it looked really pretty. So, um, until I change bags, I have it just hanging there because I didn't want it to lose its shape. Um, so we'll just start on this side. So, right here you have a, uh, sort of coat rack. I found this at Bed Bath & Beyond. Oh my gosh, I have to get rid of that curtain rack. I just realized that it's there. Okay, anyways, I got this at, um, uh, yeah, Bed Bath & Beyond. And it's just this, like, pink thing. I put a bunch of lingerie on it, just my favorite stuff. So, like, my bathrobe. Um, you know, I usually sleep in, like, these kind of silk pajamas just because I think it feels really girly. Um, this is, like, my shower getting out of the shower towel. Um, so just like really like pretty. Some of my favorite lingerie pajamas. Easy. The stuff, the thing I'm wearing now. Oh, well, hello. Underwear is kind of showing. <laughs> what I'm wearing now is uh, silk pajamas as well. Hello there. Yes. Oh, nice green underwear, Trish. Anyways. Okay, so moving on. Um, this wall. So we have the lingerie rack. Um, and then there's a poster myself. I know it seems a little narcissistic, but I've never lived on my own. I never really had my own bedroom. I always shared it with my sister like growing up. So I really just wanted to make this very Trish, and you know, I think everyone should be a little narcissistic, you know? <laughs> um, and then we got my perfume vanity here. Okay, let's just see. Okay, there we go. So this I got from Wayfair.com. I love Wayfair. A lot of my um, apartment furniture came from there. Um, so this is just a little vanity stool it came with. Pretty inexpensive, like 100 bucks for this, which I thought was a good deal. Um, underneath is just some of my more risque jewelry, as you can see, the giant sex choker. Um, and then also in there is just some Hello Kitty things, just some like collectibles. That's like a mirror from Sephora, compact, um, a bling shield lock and key, a uh, Trina Tarantino compact, and then also you guys can see my name necklaces because I wear those every day. So I have my Trisha nameplate and my monogram necklace and then my Michael Kors little wristlet underneath. Um, just kind of stuff I thought was either pretty or whatever. Um, and then I have this lipstick light, which is not on, so let me turn that on. Um, yeah, okay, here we go. There we go. So I just got that lipstick lamp at Target uh, a little couple months ago, I guess. 
Um, and then this is my perfume collection. I'm actually probably going to film, maybe today, maybe I can do a perfume collection on this, or I don't know if you guys are interested, I guess. These are all just like my fine perfumes. My body sprays and stuff are in both of my bathrooms, so these are just like my actual perfumes that I love, but if you guys want to see a more detailed, like, look into that, I can definitely show you. And then those two Hello Kitty heads are just my makeup brush holders, and then the Twinkle Lights I actually put up for Christmas, but I ended up loving. So I got too many, I got two big strands, and um, they were just too much, so I put one around my vanity. And then underneath there, I have a Henry Bendel bag, and in there are just like my Henry Bendel makeup cases, um, just because those are like the nice ones I don't want to get ruined. Um, and then moving over, I have a bunch of glossy box stack up. Just a lot of like sample size stuff is in there, just random things. <laughs> I don't really have a spot, I put them in there. I gotta go through them and organize them. Then I have my Ted. Um, and then for art, I have that cool little piece from Ikea. I really liked it. She's very a voluptuous, like, character, like, figure drawing. I don't know. I just thought it was cool. And I thought it promoted a healthy body image, kind of the body that I want. The flat tummy, definitely. Um, so then over here, we go into my stuffies corner. Um, I like to keep them on the fridge because it kind of gets annoying to keep getting them off my bed every time I want to sleep. Um, evil Furby. Oh, my gosh. Okay. So this Furby is so... Evil. Hold on, let me put the batteries in. I had to take the batteries out because it scared me. Look. Look at its evil eyes. He scares me so much. Even when you pet him, look at its evil eyes. Oh my gosh, Demon Furby. If you guys know how to, if you guys know how to turn nice, please let me know. Because I have an evil Furby and it scares me. Okay, so I had to take its battery out. That Furby scares me. It's a demon Furby. It's how I opened it. It's scary. But my other ones are very sweet. I have Pikachu, all my Hello Kitties, um, Zoom, as you guys remember from my old room, Stitch. Uh little piggy. <laughs> we called him Arnie. I have a fish. That one of my subscribers sent me for Trishy's Fishies. Just cute little stuff. Um, this is my Hello Kitty refrigerator that I got from Bad Bath & Beyond. Inside, oh, I do. I um, only keep Pink Rock Stars. They're on, <laughs> I drink those on a regular basis, so they're almost out. But um, only Pink Rock Stars are allowed in my pinker fridge. And then going over, that's like, I have tons of extension cords because I have a ton of things I plug in. Um, so we'll go over here to my nightstand. So this is my first nightstand. This is the side of bed that I sleep on. So this is all my stuff right here. Um, these lamps I got from Target. The handcuffs I got from the Hustler store. I just like the handcuffs. I know people think I'm like a freak with them. I don't really use them. I just think they look really pretty. Um, and then I have a home phone because I do live by the airport and by the beach. So like cell phone reception is like non-existent at my house. Um, then these are my sleep and stress relief lotions and pillow mist that I got from Bath and Body Works. I use that every night. This little guy I got from Ikea. I think he's so cute because I cannot sleep in pitch dark, so I have to have that. Um, and then my phone. Whoa, hello. My little phone that I always keep there and usually where I charge at night. And then I'm using up my winter candles. This is Frosted Cranberry from Bath and Body Works. Um, then down here, this is all kind of junk. I have a hair clip. I don't know, just like an empty perfume thing. I just like the box from Victoria's Secret and my remotes because I like love watching t TV in bed. Um, and then down here, I just have my Fifty Shades books, which I don't love. Um, they're just there. I got to actually get rid of them. If you guys want those, just leave a comment, I guess. I can give those away. I don't like them. I don't want to read them. There's a mini trash can back there and then another um, Victoria's Secret perfume like case thing and then a sparkly candle back there. Um, this is sort of like a junk drawer. Um, it's got my Nintendo DS box. It's got some Hello Kitty headphones. Um, my candle top to what I'm burning now. I don't know what those are. Just some gloves. My glasses I see in there. My Nintendo DS. Oh my gosh. There are condoms but it's, I, I swear I don't use them. Okay, moving on. So I usually keep my slippers here. Um, I kind of go in between, back and forth between my Hello Kitty house slippers and the house slippers I'm wearing today, which are my Snooki slippers. Um, but it's cold right now, so I definitely wear both. So let's just zoom back. Oh my gosh, I almost tripped over my <laughs> vanity. Okay, so that was that wall. So we'll go to, now to my bedroom. <sighs> this is my window, the twinkle lights. I know it's kind of like a glare now on it. Um, but I got pink curtains from Target. Um, I had to get three because I have a really long window. So I got those from Target. And the view is not much. I see my neighbors. But then 
you can kind of see, well, you guys can't, I'll have to go on the other side. You can kind of see the ocean from my bedroom, which I love. Um, and then my pillows. My favorite pillows, actually, you can't see, but it's a Victoria's Secret long body pillow back there, and it says, uh, Dream On. These sheets I got from Bloomingdale's, the leopard sheets. I love the thread count. My bed skirt and my, um, duvet cover and these shams are from Wake Up Frankie. So, like, this is from Wake Up Frankie, this is from Wake Up Frankie, Wake Up Frankie. Um, these are actually from Wake Up Frankie. <laughs> so, yeah, Wake Up Frankie have a really cute bed spreads and bed sets. So, if you're in the market for a new bed spread like I was, um, I would definitely suggest Wake Up Frankie. Uh, that's Crocodilly right there, Snooky's Crocodilly. I got that from HSN quite a while ago. And then this Parisian couch. Let me just back up into my bathroom. This Parisian couch is also from Wake Up Frankie. It's really, really big. It looks smaller on the thing, so, you know, I mean, it takes up a lot of my room. But I like it. It's a nice place for me to sit and also put my pillows at nighttime. So that is pretty much everything on that wall. We'll go over here to this nightstand. This is not very exciting on <laughs> this end because, like, no one really ever sleeps here. Sometimes my sister and my mom when they sleep over. But, again, I have a lamp from Target. Um, my St. Michael from my dad. I really like this statue because it's St. Michael. And he's stepping on the head of the devil, which I love. Um, my little crucifix. My rosary. A vanilla snowflake candle. This one I just have a, an extra value spot candle, which I really like these for my bedroom. And normally I burn only those, but I kind of am running low. Um, and I want to use up my winter candles from Bath and Body Works. Another Victoria's Secret perfume case. Um, a Hello Kitty alarm clock that I got from Talia Joy 18. And then another one of those sparkly candles. In here I just have some picture frames and the top of the candle that I'm burning now. So, yeah. So we'll back up here. Okay. And then this wall's kind of boring. Um... Basically, that is a picture that my sister painted me for Christmas. Um, she painted the background pink, and the actual sticker is like a wall decal, but since I don't own the place I live in, um, I wanted to keep it for when I moved, and also I didn't want to like paint something on my walls. So I thought that was kind of a cool thing to do with the decals, and also if you can't paint on your walls, it's a cool idea. And then pretty much over here, nothing too exciting. It's my TV. I love my disco ball. <laughs> It totally reminds me of middle school. I used to have one just like that in my bedroom. So it was a cool little throwback. I got that somewhere on the internet. I don't know where. And then there's a value spot candle burning. That's probably my champagne one. I love it. It smells so good. Oh, perfect for a bedroom. And then my two pink candles that I got from a subscriber. I never burn them. I just like the look of them. But I probably should burn them. Um, and then I got the boa from the Hustler store. And then a black silk thing to just kind of cover the table that's sitting on. Um... My last room was very pink and white and very, like, little girl, so I wanted to kind of, you know, mature a little bit, I guess you could say. Okay, and then this is just this wall right here. It's my full-length mirror. There's my pajamas from Fredericks. I love these. I think they're so comfortable. Um, yeah, and I got this mirror from Ikea. Super cheap, like $70, so I just needed it. It really opens up my room. Um, and then my door, I mean, there's just nothing, you know really there so now we'll just go into my bathroom again nothing too exciting so this is like this is my hair station I do use my main bathroom to shower and like I don't know I usually use my main bathroom just because it's bigger and I like it um but this is my bathroom these are just like my closets I am going to do a closet tour soon but I gotta get this all organized so this is basically just like sweatpants bras underwears you guys know the drill just like random stuff like pajama pants and stuff I don't know stuff that doesn't need to be organized but I do need to organize it I guess and then this is just where I keep my hair stuff there and then just like some sheets and stuff like that so just random random things <laughs> um and then in here as well I oh by the way this is a bag from Bath and Body Works and then this is my Victoria's Secret duffel bag that I normally take with me when I go on weekend trips overnight trips again this is just a closet but I have a bigger closet but these have just extra shoes extra jackets clothes stuff that I don't wear a whole lot and then oh, stuff for my move I gotta organize this guys so once I do, maybe I can give you a better tour. But if you guys want to see my walk-in closet, um, let me know in the comments below on that, too. I don't know if it's exciting for you guys. It's exciting for me, but it's because I live here, so that's probably why it's exciting. Okay, so this is my bathroom. It's pretty much just where I do my hair, hence why all my hair products are out. Um, I just blue-dried my hair and curled it and straightened it. Today I curled it with this big, big size wand from New May, and it all came in the Curl Jam kit. So um, these curls right here are just the big wand from New May. Um, 
these are just ex extra lotions in my main bathroom. I have like a bunch of sets and stuff like that. So I just have a couple Bath and Body Work sprays, some lotions, Taylor Swift lotion, a Lush pot lotion, extra soap, million dollar tan right here that I love. Um, and then a candle burning. This is Frosted Cupcake, which I think smells really good in this little area. Um, my little zebra, zebra mirror. And then my medicine cabinet, I just have... Again, random extra stuff like whitening strips I haven't used in a while. Proactive, which I don't use anymore, so I have a ton of that. But, you know, just in case, I guess. I have some heat protectant and some oil. And then right here, I got all of this from Bath... Oh, this, these two things from Bath & Body Works. I thought they were really cute. And the Lush Soap. And then those I got from TJ Maxx Home Could. It just has cotton balls and Q-tips in that one. Bath & Body Works. Um, in these drawers, just nothing exciting. I mean, just these are just drunk drawers. Makeup wipes, eyelashes, hair clips. I don't know. There's no rhyme or reason to any of this stuff. There's some more curling wands, flat irons, clips. Down here again, extra toilet paper. I don't know. Cheer for my hand wash bowls, hairspray, baby wipes, cleaning. Not that exciting. And then we got my Farrah poster, which I love. And then you open it up. And this is my tiny bathroom. I just don't really use it unless I have, like, guests over or something. Um, towel from a Bath & Body Works. Toilet paper, some tampons, a pink rug, and my shower. Not that exciting. <laughs> Once again, this is just my room. I'll just do a little 360 of it all. You know, it's cute. It's quaint. There's a mirror. Hello. Yeah. So, there's my room tour. So that was it. That's my room. I know it's pretty, like I said, pretty basic. Not so crazy. Trust me, if they had YouTube when I was a teenager, my room would have been out of control. I had posters. I had just, I had everything back in the day. But I definitely, like, you know, toned it down a little. If you think it's a lot, I toned it down quite a bit since I was a teenager. But, um... Yeah, so that is going to do it for me today. Like I said, if you guys liked this video, make sure you like it. Also, um, let me know in the comments below if you would like to see an apartment tour or a closet tour or what's in my shower. I don't know. I know people like this kind of stuff. I personally do, too. I think it's really interesting, and I think it does definitely give you guys some ideas, or we give each other ideas in a, in a sense. But, um, yeah, anyways, I love you guys so much. Uh, thank you guys for requesting this video, and I aim to please. So please, please, please let me know what you'd like to see next. Anyways, I will talk to you soon, and kissies for my fishies. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Bye guys.